Hello bratans and bratinas, welcome to my next video, two weeks review, let's start. So bratans and bratinas, I have two weeks of college behind me. My conclusion after two weeks, I mean, I really can't have a conclusion because a conclusion... Conclusion. Noun. The outcome or result of a process or act. My impression after two weeks of college is I fucked up. I really fucked up. If any one of you is asking themselves, what is this prick even doing in Vienna? I'm studying political science because I want to become a president one day. When I'm a big boy, I'll be a president. I don't know if this is gonna happen, but <laughs> who knows, you know, someone with a face like this always has a chance. I did record the the first day of school my first day of school uh, i was very proud um, to attend school uh, the first day of college i uh, went in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy you fucking prick i had hope the first day that this is going to be something a great a great uh, beginning a great start a new chapter in my life but then after the first lesson i was desperate do you want me to cry yes please <laughs> just take a look how i started morgen braten zu bratinas yo was geht ab After the, the lesson, the first lessons, the first four hours we had, I didn't even want to record anymore because it, it was so... It took so much energy out of my body. They gave me something that's called my brain push. I mean, university is kind of hard. Some even might take cocaine. Now I have something else to say about the t two first two weeks it's like hallucinating it's like i took a pill in ibiza i was just hallucinating man the first week uh, i just basically most of the time ate garbage mcdonald's kfc i mean it's good you know but it's not good for your health for your body don't eat fast food eat many vegetables and fruits and you're gonna be healthy and your body will be fantastic after one week of eating garbage i decided i want to be a creative cook i want to be better than jamie oliver oh look I'll tell me what are you going to do i'm gonna make some spaghetti Ugh. it isn't the most uh, creative thing to cook uh, basic bitch thing to spaghetti cook boys for life. shut the fuck up <laughs> After bulking, there comes fitness. And here we come to the next point, the next thing I did. One day over <laughs> the two weeks, I'm here going to the gym. By gym, I don't mean Jim Carrey. 
you gotta keep those muscles in shape because there's another thing I did. I'm going to go to the tryout for the American football team of our university. So if you have no idea what this looks like, it's basically a bunch of many guys looking like guys from high school musical we are all in this together but it's cool you know it's sports i mean american football i never played it i hope i'm not going to break my bones while doing it i hope i don't get wrecked but there's another thing you know when you move into a big city it's like having sex for the first time you don't know anything you're just there all the things you know are just from videos for the first two weeks and still to this day, my best friend in Vienna is Google Maps. I don't know shit around here. I'm from Salo. I don't know shit about big city. Although I was born in big city, I don't know shit about big city. So I had to get to know the city of Vienna. The thing I did, I just walked around the beautiful city of Vienna. But another part of getting to know the city is really getting to know the club scene. But I did go to a Balkan bar, a Balkan club and Damn, it's expensive. I mean, a shot of vodka is like 4 euros. Are you fucking kidding me? 4 euros for a shot of vodka? Way too much. If you wanna get drunk, if you wanna, if you like to drink alcohol, just go to Hofer, that's uh, um, a grocery store, I think it's a grocery store, supermarket, where you can buy vodka for like 5, 6 euros. Do that, do the Forglün, they call it, uh, it's like warming up. Before you go into the disco, drink something because it's so expensive in the discotheque. So yeah, Balkan bar, you know, I got to go to Balkan bar. I got to go to a Balkan bar to prove I'm from, I'm not from Balkan, but I'm from a former Yugoslavian country to prove myself, to see the people, to, you know what I mean, to show where I'm from, you know, you got to be proud of where you're from. Speaking of bars, I went to a karaoke bar. You see people, they don't really care about other people. They just sing, they enjoy, they enjoy the evening. They have the microphone, they sing, you know. Some sing really badly, but some sing very beautiful. And it's um, nice to see people just having fun. Another part that belongs to getting to know the city is getting to know the female side of the city. If you know what I'm saying, no? I had, uh, I had some action, you know, I had some action. Come here, baby. Had some action. It's just two weeks, okay? You know, it's hard to bring some girlies up in here in this room. Awkward situation. The flat situation. Not even a flat. It's a freaking room I'm living in. It's a room with a bathroom. It's cheap. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. In the second week, man, the second week, my creativity with cooking reached a low point. So I bought the chili con carne out of the dose. Oh, how is it called? Blech dose. Blech. 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 You don't know. So I cooked chili con carne and um, this chili con carne brought me in the little situation with my toilet. And here's another video of me and my toilet having some action together. <sighs> That was it with the toilet, you know, toilet, it's a great place. Great place, toilet, toilet, great place, great place, oh yeah. If you want me, I can do a tutorial on how to really get the most out of your sessions on the toilet. If you want me to do the tutorial, then just write it down in the comments. And speaking of new projects, um, tutorials and ideas for my videos, there will be something coming in the near future. I thought about some challenges doing on the street and a little challenge with the uh, was it called underground uh, subway? <laughs> uh, so yeah, the new projects. Um, Spaghetti boys. Oh my fucking god. Other new things that happened. I was in Slovenia, in my motherland. I went back not only to visit my motherland to get the fresh air of my motherland, but to go to a prom, the prom of my old school, of some friends of mine. And it was, it was nice. Our prom was, of course, better. I mean, come on, you know, 2000 generation. We rock this thing, this thing called life. We're young. I mean, we should live life. We shouldn't worry that much. No? And with this beautiful thought of mine, I would like to say if you have any wishes or for like, for example, places you want me to go in Vienna, please write it down in the comments because 
you know, we're working together. I have a small channel. If you have any ideas, just really write it in the comments. Comments, leave a like and subscribe, dear friends, subscribe. And with this said, thank you for watching. Bratans and Bratinas, have a nice day. Ciao.